Hello, everybody. Um, I'm going to quickly show you how I found to uh, upload music to Google Play, which includes all the metadata and album art in one single motion. Um, sick, so I do apologize for my voice, but uh, I was trying that, and it seemed like every time I was just ripping the CD to the PC, converting to MP3, and then uploading to Google Play, it took forever and um, just wasn't efficient and it did not store the metadata. So basically I wanted one motion for my Google Play to look like this for the old CDs I have sitting around. Alright, so first thing we're going to need to do is on um, downloads.com I will post a link uh, in the thing below, in the information below, uh, so you can download the uh, program, but the program is simply free free AC free audio converter so we'll just open that real quick you can also go ahead and open up uh, Google Play and I'll go ahead and make a folder I just have mp3 temp to Google Play so that's where our conversion the folder I'm going to use um, will go so as this converts it dumps it into this folder and it will upload it simultaneously so I can just minimize that for now so um, this is kind of easy to use, but uh, we'll do some um, options real quick just so you can kind of set it up how I do. Uh, general settings, um, encoder, just use lame mp3 encoder version 3.99.5. Uh, select use input for directory possible, allow overwrite input. Um, this is all okay. This just sets up how it's going to look, artist, title of song, and you can change that to whatever your preference is. I just keep it simple. Uh, then go into configure encoder, and then here you use preset A, B, R. Um, these are available too if you don't really care about the quality of your MP3, but select A, B, R. This target will slide. This will give you the different qualities on your MP3. I always go use 320. That's the less, least compression. Click OK. Uh, language obvious ripper. Here's where you can select uh, your speeds. I just use 48. You know, it's just going to use whatever the maximum can be. CD uh, DB is where it's going to rip your metadata. So enable. Um, I think that's just default. Leave it. Enable remote if uh, if it can't find it off the CD. And plugins unnecessary info tag. Um, I have write ID three uh, version two tags. And that is auto prefills. And then you can replace existing comments with default comments. Um, that's up to you. Click OK, and we should be go good to go. Down here at the output uh, directory is where you're going to browse, and you'll find uh, the folder that you uh, set up for um, Google Play to grab and upload, and just select that in. Get your CD. Sorry, I'm a little uh, unprepared. So let's see. Mm, I think I have tool here. Oh no, this is actually system of the down. This is a little easier. All right, so it's a system of the down. Again, these are just all my old CDs that um, I'm moving. So I just wanted them, had them in cloud. So dump that in. It'll read the CD. Also in the options is, um, you know, after it's done converting, it'll kick out the CD. That's nice. So here it just it just finds. Okay, is this system the down steal your album? Um, yeah, sometimes this won't pop up. It automatically knows it. I think this did the search off the internet for you. So that is what this is. There are other options here that it thinks it may be. So just click OK. It compiles. Okay, you can also click here and play the song and make sure oh, yeah, that is whatever. Um, here, uh, create playlist. This is nice. You can click that and it'll use like uh, the Explorer um, music, whatever player that is. And it just creates one button and it breaks it down to track. So it's easy to find. And then once you click that one button, then you can select your songs individually. Create cue sheet. Um, I do uh, check that. I'm not exactly 100% sure, but the format in which everything uh, is happening is correct. So that is uh, checked for me. Encode this uh, single fi uh, file. I think that's uh, if you have mixed CDs like Electronica or whatever house that are uh, play at once, 
you can just click that and it's one song all together so there's no gaps in between a continuous mix CD um, if you click on a song here artist system of the down steal this album um, titles year made etc all should be there from the metadata alright so simply once that's all set click wada bing and it begins encoding here let's give this a second So again, this is pulling the wave off the CD, ripping it, and then instantly converting it to MP3. And then Google uh, Play little tool is uh, uploading it to uh, Google Play. So I should uh, now start to see the happenings. Well, actually, here, it just recognized the first song. Give it a second here, we can verify. <laughs> Sorry, this is a resource hog. Uh, so running the recording and this simultaneously is kind of making it a little slower. Alright, so what I'll do is I'll pause, I'll come back after it's done. All right, it has finished. Um, this is the, this portion has finished. It, it takes off the song uh, when it's finished. Um, Google Play is currently uploading, so I just want to close that because it runs in the background. Can minimize this, and let me refresh. All right, so what do we have? System of the Down. Steal this album. Um, does have you know steal this album system of the down it includes the song count you can click it everything's in order from exactly how it was ripped off the CD um, I, I think that's about as easy it gets as it gets <clears throat> uh, pop a CD in press rip and you're done hope you enjoyed the video I hope it helps and um, probably the last video I'll ever do it was just so convenient I had to show everybody thank you <clears throat>